sassy mood today. So be warned. Okay, uh, this is. I am not the one person who is going to go down with the ship. As a matter of fact, if the ship is going down, I'm jumping off. Like, you think I have integrity? No, I, I don't get paid for this. Speaking of payment, this video is sponsored by absolutely no one. Because I don't get paid for this. <laughs> but I want to. So hit subscribe. Uh, please, please, uh, please hit subscribe. Actually, not to quote Sabrina Carpenter. But also, like, Short and Sweet came out today. So, you know, just throwing that out there. I love her music. Been an OG fan for a while. You know, Girl Meets World. Anyways, um, you probably saw that this already glitched. It, it is what it is. It uh, g -g 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 glitches quite a bit. But that could be my fault. And I'll tell you why here in... A second anyways if you couldn't tell from the intro the title or what's on your screen today we are reviewing the Enzoi character creator which is currently free on Steam if you want to check it out this is only a demo so keep that in mind this is by no way final software um, I'm also on my laptop which you know is currently screaming at me that it is going to die so yeah but this game has a lot with it and you know that is shown in the character creator um, it's hyper realistic. I mean, it's got these cool little traits that you're seeing on your screen. Um, you know, which if you've seen my Sims video, you know I'm an alpha CC girly. So, you know, I absolutely love the hyper realism, but you know, that could, that, that's probably just me. Um, well, not probably just me, but it's probably a lot of people, but you know, each to their own. Um, but there is also a lot of cool features that go along with this. Um, I truly do think this game is, you know, the future of gaming and thus I also believe that our technology has just become so advanced that in the next few years anyone is going to be able to run this like this is a laptop and you know despite its screams of pain it has yet to crash um anyways today i decided to make my sim self not sim self enzoi self what am i even talking about um so yeah i gave myself the mediator trait because that is my briggs myers type um, I looked for a preset that kind of resembled me. From there, I kind of just, you know, looked at the face and messed around with it. Tried to do as much as I can without, you know, seeing everything. I'm switching this to short hair so I can at least see the facial features and structure and all of that. So it's kind of easier to, you know, move around and see what I'm doing. Um, I really wanted to add that one highlight because it made everything so smooth. But I wanted to go for my typical minimal makeup look. Um, I went with the little blush with freckles because if I do wear makeup, I put on blush, I put on uh, mascara and lip gloss only. Um, so yeah, but I also have freckles. Um, you can't really see them on camera um, and they're very faint, but I do have them. Yeah, I also wanted to go for, again, minimal makeup because I literally just put on lip gloss. I don't even really put on lipstick. So I kind of tuned that all the way down. Um, and I also wanted to make the lip color a bit more realistic. I'm um, going through the hairs here. I picked um, a shorter one because in a different person who reviewed this their video, I saw that you could like adjust the hair length, but I did not have that uh, option. So I don't know if it's an option they had and they got rid of or what. But yeah, I couldn't find it. Um, so I eventually switched out for a longer hair, as you see on your screen right now. Um, tried to get it as close to my shade of red as possible. Um, obviously I didn't do, you know, roots, I probably should have, but, you know, uh, hindsight. But, yeah, now I'm working on my eyebrows, which were thinner than the original ones, and they're actually darker than my hair, um, because my actual natural hair color is dirty blonde, and it's more of a mousy brown now, it's a whole thing. I went for the, like, lighter, um, eyelashes, because I was going, if I had no mascara on or anything, um, try to make it look as natural as possible. Right now I'm adjusting my body weight. Again, try to make it as accurate as possible. But you know, I can't probably judge my own body weight because everyone's going to want to look at themselves at least a little bit skinnier than they actually are, something to make them feel good. So this could be off, but I, I tried to be as realistic as possible. Then I, you know, gave myself some pink undies because I love the color pink. And yeah, that's my vibe lately. Pink, green, and light blue, like all the pastel colors. Give me a white any day, a cream. Um, yeah, I was also disappointed by the tops though because they didn't have any like sweaters They had sweatshirts and like cardigans and stuff, but they didn't have sweaters and I typically wear longer sweaters over my leggings I was able to find you know styled leggings I typically wear but I couldn't find a sweat uh, like a sweater 
However, this little sweatshirt with the cat patch is actually perfect because, no pun intended, um, I love cats a lot. And so, you know, I just kind of wanted to go with it. I'm readjusting my face because I was looking at a picture of myself and I realized my face is a bit rounder, my lips are a bit wider. I do have very thin lips naturally, but, you know, um, I couldn't exactly get them to where they're supposed to be. I love that coat, by the way. I, I love the coat. And this, uh, that sweater right there is actually I have that one in real life and I get it to match the exact color too and I got it because I was Lucy in Narnia at my school production last year I am in school that's why video uh videos they're going to be a bit more spaced out because yeah I'm a college student I do college things I I have to do work um but the socks I have an issue with the socks because they were glitching out pretty bad I mean I try to get the shoes as accurate to shoes I have as possible um I wish there was more tennis shoes options to be fair and I wish there were shorter sock lengths because I only wear ankle socks because I can't stand them any higher than that but the socks themselves it's like I couldn't get the ones under the leggings to be white um I could get them to be gray but I couldn't get them to be white so I settled for a black to make it like not really stand out so it kind of matched more but yeah that's my zoi um I hope you enjoyed this video make sure to hit like and subscribe bye I'll see you in the next one